And hey everyone, it's Justin here. Welcome back to Pokemon Gaia version. In the last episode, we made it through the Wisp Forest and we were able to get the Mystic Badge back from Fernando. So in this episode, we are going to go ahead and continue on. I looked into it. I don't think there's anything else to do in this town yet. And we are just going to go find that second entrance, which I located literally right up here. Okay, see this entrance? This is where we came from. This is the second entrance. So hidden. It was hidden behind little trees that you should be able to just walk past, but you can't. Let's move up here. Justin! Oh, now you show up. That looks like the exit we were looking for. I'll go and get Chase. All right. Whoa, this place is insane. Really? There's no It's just the same as Arch and Tunnel. How have I never found this before? I don't know. How did you not find this before? This tablet is fascinating. It looks a lot like the one in Argentown, doesn't it? Hmm. Looks like a Tangrowth. These glyphs at the base, they seem familiar. Aha! I remember now. An old friend of mine used to study this language. His name is Herschel. He's a Pokemon trainer, too. If we're going to translate this tablet, we'll certainly need him. Last I heard, he was headed to Arrow City to curate its museum. The two of you should go and find him. All right, Justin, I'll race you to Arrow City. Deal. Okay, so we gotta beat him. Like, he got a head start on us, but I think I could probably beat him. Okay, so we need to actually go east of town, over here. The Eros Valley. What is that? Okay, those are trainers, okay. I thought that was a rare Pokemon or something. So let's just go down here. Fight you. I love the fresh air, air out here. It makes me want to battle. Okay, I don't I don't know what the correlation between air and battling is. Like, I understand you like to breathe while you battle. Like, that's cool. Like, I like to breathe too. But, like, why does air make you think of battling? Not very effective. What do you mean, not very effective? Of course it's very effective. Actually, it isn't. Okay, so there we go. Sweet. And what else do you got? Should probably switch out. Oh, we got a Growlithe. Okay, so maybe I shouldn't switch out. Oh, it's so cute. I love Growlithe. That looks adorable. Let's just see if we can use a wing attack and get rid of this thing. Okay, get a critical. That's fine with me. That's really okay. Youngster Harry. Looks like I'm fresh out of luck. Looks like you need to stop breathing air so you can stop battling people. Actually, let's read the sign real quick. What does this say? Arrows Valley, Zeros Village that way, and then Arrow City this way. Okay, cool. We're on the right way. Hey there! I I love... What? What? What did he say? They're my favorite. Let me show you. I didn't even read what he said. Like, it sounded really weird, though. Okay, so Bugcatcher Michael. See, that's a normal name. Not like Shiro, which is Japanese. Or what was the other guy's name? Uh, Dimitri. I just didn't... That didn't fit him at all to me. I don't know. So anyways, we're about to get level 16. Very nice. I think we're getting close to evolving. I, I'm really hoping. Because Shiro evolved would be awesome. Watch it be like, oh, it evolves at level 30 in this. That would suck. I just feel bad. Like, I'm just breezing through it. I'm not even talking about this battle. That, that, that's how easy it is. And that gave me a lot of XP. I guess my Pokemon and I weren't strong enough. That's true. Uh, let's see. I'll probably... I don't know. Should I, like, switch? Like, I I'm, I'm seem to be fighting Pokemon that, like, I can just easily destroy with Shiro. So I'm like, I don't really want to switch. No, ooh, you can get Wild Snubbles out here. That's cool. Okay, so let's keep going. Uh, so it looks like we can fight that girl. Can we just fight her? I think it looks like you can just go up and avoid her. No trainer right there. Um, let's just fight her. Why not? Do you think I'm a strong trainer? Let me show you. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'm fine with assessing your Pokemon. Like, if you understand that you're not the best, but you want to find out, like, kind of where you are in the chain, like, that's fine. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm happy to oblige you and help you out in that way. But the trainers who are just like, oh, yeah, I'm the best. Like, no one can ever defeat me. When you have, like, level, like, 10s, you're not the best. You, you've you probably fought like two people and they were probably little kids because there is a lot of little kids in this. 
So don't act like you're the best, because you're not. So anyways, we got a double team. I'm actually going to learn that just in case there's a gym or something I get stuck on and I need to use cheap strategies. You know, double team helps. Okay, so cool. Uh, a Piplup. Okay. That is really interesting. I should have switched out. Should have used uh, Razor Leaf. But that is really cool that you have a Piplup. I, I'm actually, like, genuinely impressed. That That's not an easy Pokemon to obtain. Unless it is in this game. I don't know. Maybe it is. Like, that's a good question. Can you obtain the other uh, starters? Like, I'm really curious now if they're easily obtainable. Or if you can just, like, find them in the wild or... I don't know. I like games that, like, put the uh, starters in the wild. I think that's just cool. It looks like you can go down. What's down here? Like, I'm not seeing anything down there. I guess we'll go down there real quick. There's an item. Be careful not to fall. Yeah, I wouldn't want to fall into this. Like, I'd get all wet and I would just be... Eh. Picnic or Roxana? It doesn't have two ends. Like, that's... That's weird to me. Um... Pachirisu. Let's see, let's use a quick attack and see if that'll do damage. I really didn't do much damage. And you're gonna lower my attack, too. I might switch out, because I don't want to deal with that. Uh, let's go into Sora real quick. Oh, and then you're gonna growl me? Okay. That's fun. Let's see. Gosh, stop using Charm and Growl. What is this? Is this the only moves you know? Now I'm never gonna defeat this thing. I might have to switch back. Yeah, look at that. That did nothing. Okay, so we're gonna switch back into Shiro and hope it doesn't do that again. Oh my. Are these the, literally the only moves you know? That is so annoying. Gosh, I do no damage to this thing. I really don't do any damage. This, this is such a troll fight. Like, they just put this here to be annoying. Not even to be a challenge, but just to sit here and deal with this. Okay, good. Thank you. Thought I was going to take another turn. Okay, so don't do that fight. Like, whatever item this is, I don't care if this is a Master Ball. It's not worth it. I think I want to jump. Maybe you should jump in the water. Cool down after... Ooh, a leaf stone. Okay, it was worth it. That's actually kind of nice that they give that to you so early. I wonder what you would use to evolve. Um, I don't really know. There was a few grass types we encountered, so maybe one of those. Uh, I'm not really sure. Okay, so looks like we're in... Yeah, Eros Village. Uh, what is this? It's like a fairy. Yo, this place is out of bounds at the moment. Sorry, small fry. What? I'm not a small fry. I'm guessing this is the museum. Yep, it looks like there's like a bodyguard or something in the front. Hello. As a sailor, I've become accustomed to the sharp, salty air of the sea. Some people are not used to it, however. I don't know, like, you live in a port town, like, you should be accustomed to it. Ooh, is that an island? Oh, never mind, it's just a rock. Okay, can you let me in? The Eros Museum is, uh, having an exhibit. Yeah, you don't believe me? Oh, right, you're a be belligerent child. That's a weird word. I'll make you pay. Okay. So who is this guy? Ooh. Museum clerk. I don't believe that. I don't believe that he's a museum clerk. I think he's uh, part of the teams in this game. I wonder what the team name is. I'm really curious to know. I didn't even think about that. Like, there's probably, like, a, a team and maybe another team in here. Like I said, I don't, I don't know anything about this game, so... This is really cool to me to see something new that's actually, like, really well done so far. Alright. Uh, just some bundle bees, I guess. Like, I can deal with that. And we're almost level 18. Like, that's crazy. Like, we're ahead of, uh... We're ahead of Sora right now. That's pretty nice. Because Shiro was, like, four levels behind. So Shiro definitely needed to catch up. Really badly. All right, cool. Level 18. I wonder if we're going to evolve. A Hoot Hoot. Uh, yeah, we'll just stay in, because I doubt I doubt Sora's going to be able to do anything to a Hoot Hoot. Let's see if we can use a wing attack right here. Okay, just one-shot this thing. That's cool. I'm okay with that. Who are you, really? Oh, man, this isn't good. 
I'm gonna run and tell his boss. I'm calling it. Oh man, this is bad. I gotta go tell the boss. I knew it. I knew it. I could tell from the words he used. La -dee -da, -dee da See, this is nice and peaceful. Ugh, they allowed this boring piece in here, but they reject my beautiful painting of a blade of grass? It's a symbolic use of negative space. I agree, it is a symbolic use of negative space. You should have your one blade of grass in here. What's going on upstairs? The guy at the stairs isn't letting anyone pass. I don't know, maybe you should talk to the front lady about this. Hello, enjoy pursuing our subjects. Okay, so she's ignorant, okay. I love taking pictures with my camera. Yeah, you're one of those guys. Hello. Nobody can go upstairs. Important business is going on. Don't look at me like that. I'll look at you any way I want to. Rude. Mysterious Grunt. Okay, so we don't know their team name yet. What it appears to be. Uh, after this fight, I'm going to switch out a Shiro. And hopefully, they'll have Pokemon that I can use uh, Sora with. Yeah, it looks like they have a lot of, like, flying types or something. I wonder if they're, like, a flying type team. Like, that would be really cool. Like, no joke. Like, I would love to see a flying type team. Or a psychic team. That'd be cool. Let's see. A Bunnelby. Okay. So, we'll get rid of this real quick and then switch back into Shiro. And maybe we get to have a boss fight upstairs. That would be cool. I don't know. I don't know if I can take a boss. Like, they would probably be pretty powerful. But I think I could. Like, I'm pretty high leveled right now. So let's switch into Sora real quick. I was about to say Shiro. We're already, we already have Shiro up there. Ooh, one second. Death got an item. A citrus berry. Nice. We'll definitely be using that in the future. Let's see. Let's go over here. Looks like we have two battles before we get to important stuff. How did you get up here? I used the stairs. No, I used the elevator. There was totally an elevator. No, I used the stairs. Uh, Rog and Rolla, okay. Definitely glad we switched. Like, what is their team? Like, are they like a rock type? Ground type? Kind of psychic type? I don't know. A lot of their Pokemon seem to be psychic type. So that's what I'm guessing. Which I'm okay with because I think that's really cool. I'm, I'm really hoping they're like a psychic rock type or something, you know? Something cool like that. All right, so who do you got next? A Bunnelby. You guys have a lot of Bunnelbees. Now, what type is Bunnelby? Is Bunnelby ground type? I think Bunnelby is ground type. We're going to test that out real quick. Let's use a Razor Leaf and see if it's super effective or not. Uh, it is not. So what is Bunnelby? Like, I, I genuinely don't know. Okay, so get rid of you. Fine with me. Okay, so let's see. I only asked... That, that is true. I have to give credit where credit's due. He only asked where I came from. What is that sign? Ooh, I see somebody over there. Do you know who you're dealing with? We're the New Elders. Is that really their team name? New Elders? You were challenged by New Elders Grunt. It's, ooh, you have a fossil? That is interesting. The Grunts have fossil Pokemon. Oh, that's really cool. New elders. So like, I guess they're trying to replace the old elders, but who are the old elders? I don't, I'm not really sure. Okay, it's getting our stats up. And I think this is where we evolve. It's either at like 18 or 20. I only lost because this is a cramped space. Sure, buddy. Sure. <gasps> Yay, Sora's evolving. Awesome. I'm really happy about that. Because now Sora's going to be so much stronger. And especially if we're fighting a boss right here, I'm definitely going to need this, this evolution right here. Now, unfortunately, Shiro didn't evolve, though. So what level does Shiro evolve? Yeah, 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 we got a Grottle. Cool. Didn't learn any new moves, though. And that is our main priority. Your help would be invaluable. So I don't know if any of you guys play Overwatch or not, but that looks like Anna right there. Like, if, if I've ever seen Anna, that is Anna right there. I've already given you my answer. It would not be prudent to ask again. Herschel, I feel I have no... Oh, you're, you're going too fast for me. I didn't even click anything. Ma'am, the child was talking about is here. I Oh, I was talking about was here. Wow, I'm totally butching their speech right now. Uh, don't interrupt. It's clear I won't be persuading you anytime soon. Thank you for your time. We're finished here. Wow, they're actually very polite. 
Oh, good day, child. I presume you saw that. If you are curious, those people were ridiculous fanatics. I want no involvement with them. I hope you don't mind my asking, but is that a Redwood card you have pinned on your jacket? Yes, it is. It is? Ex oh, how extraordinary. Charles, er, Professor Redwood is a great friend of mine. So he is Charles Redwood, then. Okay, that's cool. What's that? He sent you here to find me? Yep. Arch and Tunnel, the old language? How intriguing. I would love to help very well. I will wait for you at the exit of Arrow City, and we can go together. I shall see you there. Now, I just have to give credit where credit's due. I think it's awesome that they just do a lot of events where they kind of like, I don't know, take you places. I don't know if that's the first time. No, that's the second time. That's why I'm mentioning it. The The first time was in the Wisp Forest. They just kind of guide you out automatically. I love that they do that. That's such a nice feature. All right, so we might as well go the whole way. Are you ready? Sure. Yeah, see, it's awesome that they just take you where you need to go. Like, they don't have you walk all the way through there. It's just so annoying having to do that. Charles, it is great to see you. So you want this to be translated? Very well. Let's see. This is quite cryptic. I can only decipher the odd word. It seems to be saying the earth is waking up. The earth is waking up. It mentions Apex Temple here. Apex Temple? That's the temple the peak of Mount Ignis, right? Rumor has it the elders of Orbta stored their knowledge there. Maybe we can find some answers about the tremors from the temple. Justin, the mis mystery unfolds. How exciting. You should head to Apex Temple. That means climbing Mount Ignis. Okay. I'll, I'll be glad to do that. That sounds cool. Like, all the knowledge of the elders of Orbtus. I think the passage in this room continues on to Salanto Path. To continue through, you'll need this. It's HM06 Rock Smash. Okay, cool. Herschel, it has been a pleasure like always. Thanks for your help. Anytime, my dear friend. I'm afraid I must leave now, though. I have duties to attend to. Farewell, Charles and er, trainer. Didn't even ask my name. I will pass the message on to Chase. If you need me, I'll be back at my home in Argentown. Good luck, Justin. Okay, so how come we didn't meet Chase there? And you know we are going to fight uh, the new elders up at, up at uh, what is it, Mount Apex or Mount Ignis? Apex Temple, yeah. So anyways, guys, I think that is quite a bit we got done in this episode. We went all the way to Arrow's Town, which I don't know if it has a gym or not. It probably did have a gym, and we might need to go back there at some point. But for now, I guess we'll just continue on with the story, unless we need to go back and fight the gym. I'm not really sure. So anyways, guys, uh, pretty exciting episode. I'm, I'm happy with our progress. So I shall see you guys next time.